Brooks exclusive. guys welcome back to my channel it's Brandy Giz and I am back to share with you all my favorites for this month last month it really don't matter I just felt like doing my favorites while I have the time and I'm gonna kick them out for you because I've been using these products and I've been loving some of them some of them I've been liking but for the most part if it made the cut it's Brandy approved so we're gonna start in no particular order and I'm gonna start with perfumes okay the scents from Dossier are these two scents Floriental marshmallow this smells so good and this is the Killian's version I think love don't be shy if I'm not mistaken but I'll put it on the screen this is a really nice sweet warm smell that I truly love it smells so good it it's just just like a that warm scent that just you want to hug somebody when you smell it so I like this one I also love the um, ambery saffron this smells good too y'all this is the baccarat version 540 baccarat rouge 540 get your hands on this i promise you you will not be disappointed okay so we got those out the way and i want to talk about two more perfumes that um i received probably about two three weeks ago y'all it's in rotation now this one is these two are by lux xb and you just twirl it right there this is like a monthly subscription and you just open it up and it's small enough to fit like in your purse so you can carry it with you these two on the other hand you probably don't want, don't want to be carrying these 1.7 fluid ounce bottles in your purse but these are just the right size to fit in any purse car wherever the case may be your locker um but yeah these two scents are hands down my favorite and this one is julia has a gun pear ink now julia has a gun you can find it on the sephora website but you can also get it on lux xb i'm not going to tell you too much about it but lux xb and these two are my favorite this is the julia has a gun all day perfume and i did a video on some of their scents i have more from them but check out check out that video that i did that i was finally able to release this right here is some good stuff it smells so good and especially like if i go in a patient's room or something like that they always like say mm, what do you have on you smell good i had a patient on today she was like what is that that you're wearing it smells so good and i let her know where she can get it and yeah that's like a great compliment and this one is christian Suriano. this smells really good too this is the oula rouge and i like this scent too it's like this one right here it smells like really nice crisp classy just that kind of like when you leave the room your scent kind of like lingers but it's not an obnoxious linger like girl what does she have on it, it's not that kind it's that oh she smells good kind of perfume and this one too it smells really good it's like a warm it's like a warm scent but i really like this um julia has a gun the pear ink it's just it smells good the dry down is like the bomb okay so enough of that i spent too much time on that but anyway my next item is the josie mirror whipped argon oil as you can see i'm almost out i say i got about three more days of it and it'll be gone so i want to let you all know that i love it i love the scent it makes you smell so good and i can come home from doing a eight hour shift so I would say I'd be gone like 14 hours. I'll come home to take my shower and I can still smell the scent like on my arms when I'm like pulling off my clothes. That's how you know you have something really good. So I suggest you go out and get this. It has a really nice like vanilla bean smell and I believe the scent is vanilla bean. Let me make sure. It's whipped body butter pure yep vanilla bean. This is the bomb you guys it smells really good okay let's move on to hair uh care care this is a hydrating shampoo i like this i like how it gives me that slip and i also like the apogee because i have like blonde in my hair and you know you gotta take care of this blonde child be trying to shed and 
break off and stuff like that so i use the deep moisture shampoo to make sure that i have a moisture in my hair at all times um i'm not a beautician by any means but i just try to use what works for me and the effigy uh has been working it's uh it just makes your your styling time easier it restores the body and vibrancy and controls frizz and it also has a nice yeah it has a nice clean shampoo smell so i like to use these two and it works for me okay let's talk about skincare real quick we're gonna just dive right in through it y'all my skin has been going through a little thing okay and i guess because of the mask and whatnot and then i had this breakout that turned like dark and i was like what in the world and i noticed if i get pimples they'll turn dark and i don't like that so this is what i've been using i've been cleansing my face with CeraVe. i've been using this for a minute this is my second bottle and this is really good it's the renewing sa cleanser for normal skin it gently cleanses exfoliate softening and it's a smoothing skin and i found this at walmart okay and i also got back on the ran which is the um it's like a it's like a lotion kind of like a toner lotion and it, it works for me okay because i couldn't get my hands on the regular toner i think it was limited edition it was like in a bluish packaging so i've been using this and you know i've been doing this little mask from detox i think it's by teamy i've been doing this mask now i don't i'm, I'm sponsored by them but i don't i purchased this one with my own money and this is the teamy detox green tea blend and I've been using it like on the areas of where I'm having problems. And I noticed that that dark spot has lightened up. Because it was looking real ugly in one of my videos. I was just like, oh my god. I don't like the way that looks. Okay. So I have been using the Ordinary. And this is the Natural Moisturizing Factor. And I'm not just throwing stuff in here to make a video. This is the stuff that I've been really, really using. Okay. And this is the Natural Moisturizing Factors Plus HA. And this is a really good moisturizer. I'm going to bring it close so that you can take a screenshot this is really nice i do like a real little pea size on my hand my hand and i just go over it in the morning time since i have to wear a mask and i just like the fact that it works okay another hair product is this one this is my edge control i don't have it on today but when i do use the edge control it's this one from amazon it's called the instant control edge and braid gel this is the maximum hold love it okay girl i try not to leave home without these these are my airpods i love them girl i need them because i can just put this in my ear especially when you have that co-worker just doing too much talking and i just zone out <laughs> i'm sorry but yeah it's just when you're on your lunch okay you shouldn't have it in your ears when you're not you know on your lunch or your break but yeah girl for the most part i love these um especially when i'm trying to listen to something that i don't want others to hear or they might not understand you know they could be speaking in tongues or talking about come out come out in jesus name they trying to do the deliverance and people don't be understanding or knowing they're like well girl what is you looking at you know so you can just have on your earphones and listen or if you want to listen to some songs some music you want to hear that bass that's what you need you know so i like these and let's move forward okay so i know y'all looking at this like what is that this is a mascara from huda i actually have this this is the way it comes this is like a sampler i got it upside down this is the huda beauty it's the major volume dramatic curl and in instant shine and it's actually two in one okay you have one on one end and one on the other if you see this pick it up from sephora it is the bomb you guys and it comes with i didn't notice until like um i had one in the car and i reached for one in my little desk drawer thing and i used it and it gives like the best lengthening i put it on the lower part of my lashes and it just it gives really nice volume and length i love this stuff so i did buy a smaller one i don't know where it's up it's somewhere around here but I always use these for my purse. Hands down the best mascara. I do have Gucci. I like Gucci. Unfortunately, girl, it was cold one day. 
and I twisted and I pulled it out and the brush got stuck in the dipper thing so that's a like a, a fail okay this is good stuff too this is from summer friday and it's the lip butter balm smells really good this is vanilla it's really nice and there's no color to it or anything but it just makes your lips look really moisturized glossed looks good i like it okay and for eyes i've been using this huda beauty palette did i use that on today yeah i used this on today i did use a little bit of norvina um did i use any norvina let me see yeah i did i used love in here and the norvina so i've been like kind of switching out with these two along with there's one more palette that i've been using okay and this is the, another palette that i've been using this is the aphrodite palette i got this on i think etsy or or something i can't remember no it wasn't etsy it was like a website that they no no, no longer sell this but i seen it on amazon something similar and this is the bad habit palette girl this palette looks so bad it is bad but honey you can get an amazing eye with that look and i think let me see was that it I think I have one more item, which is, oh, here's a lippy that I've been loving too. And it's by NYX. It's called Lingerie. This is the Bear With Me. And it's just a pretty nude. And I'm rocking today my snob from MAC. And that will complete this here video, I believe, because, oh, let me show y'all the moisturizer from the Apogee line that I do like to use too. This is the Apogee Balancing Moisturizer and it goes with the conditioner and I do love it. I do love it. Yeah. Um, there's one item that I didn't like which is the mane and tail. I don't know. I didn't like it. I'm going to give it a, a little spin one more time to make sure but for the most part I don't think I like it. It kind of like dried out my hair so no and the bag that i've been liking is this one right here and i just fit everything up in this bad boy you see that so yeah i'm gonna list the name of where you can purchase this louis vuitton this big old bag that you just throw everything in i love it um you can buy it but yeah that will complete my favorites you guys i hope that you enjoyed this here favorite oh let me show y'all this this is the beauty bakery flower and i really been liking that underneath the eye it doesn't make my eye look too white yeah i like it because it don't make my eyes look like white i spray a little bit and pat <laughs> yeah but i like that and the foundations that i've been wearing that I've been liking is from Huda Beauty. It's that stick. And this one is called Gingerbread number 430. And I like the Hourglass stick because it's real quick. And this one is in Warm Almond. And that is about it. I've been loving these eyelashes. I can't. I think they're the number 51s by La Flair, which is the New York Mink lashes these are 55s but these aren't the same that i have on my eyes but yeah i like those yeah that is about it so i'm gonna get off of here i thank you all for watching and don't forget to comment rate subscribe to the channel and i will see you in the next video until then have a blessed one y'all love y'all